What's up, YouTube, and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to Pokemon, uh, what are we playing? Emerald, the insanely randomized Nuzlocke, episode number 25. In the last episode, which was yesterday, we had our Surf Excursion Part 2, uh, where we w finally got Surf, and we made our way from Duford up to Slateport, where we're at right now. Uh, along the way, we encountered some power, and we stopped at the abandoned uh, abandoned ship and caught ourselves a new mon. Uh, and took out all of the stuff there. We did a whole bunch of stuff in the last episode. So if you missed that and you want to check it out, make sure you click the i-card before you watch today's episode. In today's episode, we're going to be possibly doing the new Mauville uh, event. After the last episode, I after I stopped recording the last episode, I, I thought... I'm not sure if new Mauville event is like if we can do that right now. If we can, then we're going to go ahead and do that. We also will potentially do a mid-episode grinding montage because I really want to use Tanashi, uh, our Suicune, but I haven't had the chance to grind them. I really haven't had the need to grind them up. Uh, but let's very quick. Oh, if you're excited for today's episode of Pokemon Emerald, make sure you hit the like button down below. Subscribe if you are new and comment whatever we come up with for the question of the day, which you can see right below the game. It really helps out and I appreciate it a lot. Let's do a quick team recap. Since this is a Friday episode, we don't need a full team recap. Uh, we're just going to go through it quickly. We have Kajitan, our dragon Altaria, who just blows everyone away. We have GM, our Steel Rock Umbreon, who we can count on to take any hit. We have Oscar, our Fire-type Sceptile, who has been there for us the longest. Rustlin, our Fighting Rock-type Torkoal, who surprisingly is still with us. Nanashi, our Normal-type Suicune, who I just cannot wait to use this Pokemon. And then new to our team is Dedecus, our uh, Psychic-type Loudred with Rain Dish, Rash Nature. Stats are here. He's got to be leveled up quite a bit. Uh, and with Rage, Zap Cannon, Attract, and Defense Crow, is kind of useless right now. But uh, that is our squad. Let's lead. I really want to just lead Tanashi. I think what we're going to do is we're going to head to New Mauville. And if we can get there, um, we're going to catch a Pokemon. And then decide on our team of six. And then jump into a mid-episode grinding month. Uh, That way I don't train up this Loudred and there wind up being like a Mew in New Mauville. But I'm not down for that. But let's head to Mauville. Thank you. Gracious. Also, if we finish New Mauville quickly today, which I doubt we will, uh, we're going to head to... Uh, oh, cool. Here we go. Oh, ho, ho. Domino, you look like you have a lot of zip. It's a good thing. <laughs> Fine, I've decided. I need a favor, Domino. Mobile City has an underground sector called New Mobile. Domino, I'd like you to go there and switch off the generator. The generator has been running a bit haywire. It's getting unsafe. Here, this is the key to get into New Mobile. Don't worry about it. It won't be a challenge to you. The interest in New Mobile is just a short surf away from Route 10. That's it then, you have my trust! Alright, Watson. You got it, my guy. Alright, so um actually just had this thought too. Avoid, avoid, avoid wild Pokemon. Avoid wild Pokemon. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Wait, 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 wait. I have an idea. Oh could not avoid. Alright, let's, uh, I know there's items all around here. I'm pretty sure I have to surf from down. Okay, I just, okay, alright, so here's, here's what my brain just did. In Pokemon Reborn, I need to catch a Sunkern in order to trade it for something. So I saw that Sunkern and I was like, oh, I need to catch that. <laughs> Wrong game. Executor, see this is gonna, I think the grinding session is gonna go by really quick. Because I have like level 20s and and etc to train on the Nashi's grinding will especially go quick. Wait a minute. I didn't know I could surf all the way over wait why can I surf all the way over here I 
I know the game thinks it's gonna trick me. I guess the game tricked me. Okay. To New Marvel, we go catch a Pokemon. And then to grinding montage. I'm not running through the grass. I don't want to run into wild. Oh my goodness. Why are there only grass Pokemon? Avoid. Avoid. Yes. Okay. Is there anything else? Not believe so. All right, let's run around and find ourselves an encounter. Rustlin's up front, right? Yes. Okay. What you got for us, New Mobile? What you got for us, New Mobile? What you got for us, New Mobile? Thank you. First encounter, New Mobile is an evolving Pokemon. That's all I see in front of me. I don't see anything else. Milk drink. Moonlight. Milk drink. Moonlight. Super Sun. Wow. Literally the most annoying Pokemon I've ever encountered in my life. Besides any Clefables, if I've ever encountered a Clefable. Because I hate Clefable. Clefable could die in a fire, and I would probably throw a party. Not Cleffa. Fable. Alright, so we did catch this Hopip. The Cottonweed Pokemon. Pokemon drifts and floats with the wind. If it senses the approach of strong winds, a Hoppip links leaves with others to prepare against being blown away. Every time I read something successful, I'm going to start fist pump. Let's go! Brain! Okay, so its name, her name, is going to be Usha. The Hoppip. Oh, it was transferred. Oh, I'm stupid. That's okay. Ain't no thing but a chicken wang. We're already back at the Pokemon Center. All right. Whoop. 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 I don't really need to heal right now. Move. Wait, get out of the sacred fire box. You're doomed. All right, well, you're literally doomed. Oh, suck. All right, let's check out Usha, our Hopip. We have a flying type Usha. Level 24 with color change, terrible. Brave nature. It's not bad, I guess. I think that lower speed raises attack. Holding the Never Melt Ice, which is kind of cool. Milk Drink, Double Edge, Moonlight, and Supersonic. Okay, you're useless. Now, here's what I think I'm going to do. I won't be changing the layout, but in this grinding montage that we're going to do, I'm pretty sure you don't evolve until level 36. So I might start off by evolving Hopip. And then depending on what it evolves to, I might grab Didacus and evolve it. If it's level 36. If it's level 40, I probably won't grab it. Uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. But we're going to go ahead and jump into a grinding montage. We'll be back in a minute. I hope you enjoy the music.
we're back after that uh, that grinding montage. <sighs> so, uh, currently we have Tanashi at level 31. Uh, I just kind of wanted to jump back into it because uh, grinding was taking a bit of a while. That defense almost got Tanashi killed. That defense almost got Tanashi killed. Uh, but strength is extremely powerful. But I was switch training. Hop it. No, I wasn't. I decided to try and use Hopip for a battle, and uh, the, if you just skipped over it, um, called it. I said that he had jinxed himself. So Hopip is dead. And do we do have Loudred, our uh, what's his name, Dacus? Dacus is still with us, only up to level 21, so 10 levels up. Doesn't evolve to level 40, so it's like... I will grind it up for real the next time I do a real grinding month. Not one of these mid-episode mid grinding month. I started training against these stupid things, but they're ghost type, so my strength didn't even work. Super annoying. Alright. Our new Mavil. Another hop ips. That's so sad. I <laughs> transferred to the wrong box. He should have thought about that before he trans. Wait, why is this? Why is this button all the way over here? This makes no sense. Boink, boink evolves. I just don't know if hop ip would have evolved in anything good. Could have had a primate. That would have been cool. I would have been down for that. You still have the lucky egg on our. Uh... Who you might call it? Tanashi. We'll have the lucky egg. On a sharp beak, that's not a master ball. A Pokemon? Do I count this as a static encounter? I count this as a static encounter how about i catch it and we can decide later so i'll need you to let me know in the comments below if i should count this as a if it lives i'll catch it bone meringue is the move i have been saying bone meringue will destroy my team Literally everybody that gets hit by Bone Meringue will die. Alright, let's go this way for If I have another one. Pretty sure one of these is static. So, let's put Rustlin up front first. On the sharp beat. Okay, this is a static Pokemon. So I will be catching it. It's a Magneton. Since it's dupes, I'm gonna opt to not catch it. Even though ours died. Oops. Even though our Magneton died. Probably to a sacred fire. Just saying. Uh, a Croconaw. That's cool. Lovely kiss. Gosh darn it. That's okay. Do you have anything else? You have Rapid Spin. How useless are you? Alright, let's go with a gray ball. And... It pops straight out. Alright, we caught it. So, there we go. We have Croconaw, the big jaw Pokemon. Once its jaw is clamped down on its foe, it will absolutely not let go. Because the tips of its fangs are forked back like fish hooks, they become irremovably embedded. Something, something, it hooks. They should have, they should have rhymed that. Okay, so we have Croconaw, or as we're going to know him, Idea. <laughs> Alright, um, now, we're not going to, I don't think I want to look at these. Because I don't want their, 
stats and stuff. Actually, I guess technically you could look that up in the paste bin. So never mind. Wait. Did I go the wrong way? I thought this was the wrong way. That's why I went this way. But I'm pretty sure this is not static. That's normally a thunderstone. Instead, it's an orange male. What a waste. Wait, why am I not using Tanashi? Oh, yeah, yeah. Static Pokemon. Also, there's no trainers in here. Why did I think there would be trainers in here? That's literally like the whole thing with this game. With this little area. That it's like closed off. And I am running into so many wild Pokemon. Oh my goodness. Anybody enjoy wild Pokemon? Did I come up with the question of the day? Crap. Wait. Oh my goodness. This is the equivalent of the dark cave. This is absolutely miserable to go through. This episode is just all over the place. I better have an escape rope. Because I am out. I'm out, actually. I am. They call me nappy because I am Audi 5 bajillion. Alright. Now. I don't know how long this episode is. But I only got one static mon from that. Oh! Whoa! I knew it, Domino! I knew you'd I'd make the right choice asking you. Yeah. This is my thanks, a TM containing ice beam. Go on, you've earned it. Whoa! It pleases me to no end to see the young step up and take charge. Alright, um Ashi, go ahead and come up. I don't know how long this episode is. I'm hoping it's not gonna go too long. But there's something we can do. Who remembers our Houndoom that died 10 minutes after I caught it? Spoilers! I don't know why you're watching this episode. Hey, look, Cleffa. I will not kill you this time. Okay, that, you think you're hilarious. And I know right now, I know you're laughing right now. Anyway. Let's do this. Little surf spot. Pretty sure. We maneuver our way this way and find some peoples to train on. That's a secret base. We got all kinds of secret bases back here. Sent out a Waylord. How'd you like that, Waylord? A Corsola? More like Corsola, no. Well, that actually. A bit more like. Why are you steel tight? Why did I just press A? Sometimes I just mash. Sometimes I just mash. He said, you! My Machop! You demand a battle! No, not flame body! Oh no, flame body! Let's heal, let's be smart. Intelligente. Again, I don't know how long this episode is, so that's part of the reason why I'm speeding up everything. <laughs> ah! Wait, what's up there? We're never gonna find out, because I'm not coming back. That's like some super secret item. Let me know. I might consider. Right, here we go. Here we go. We got some double battle action. Tindaquio and Butterfree. You're dead. Yeah, nobody's getting hit by Tanashi and living. Ratata! That bone meringue! That bone meringue. That's not funny. People think that's funny. 
thing. I can't get around you? Oh, okay, I can just go this way. All right, let me heal. Wait. Jim, I've been using you too much. Let's go with the newbies. Let's see how the newbies do in this battle. Septile and Graveler. Let's go. No, 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 no. Let's go like this. Like this. Dead. Dead. Everything is going to die right now. I feel like I got really quiet over the last, like, minute. I don't know. Maybe I didn't. All right, that's it. And we already have an encounter for this area, right? This isn't like a different area. Let's try 115. Yeah. Okay, cool. So that's going to be it for today's episode. This is probably the most scatterbrained episode that I've ever recorded. That's not true, but it certainly was very scatterbrained. Let's let's say that for sure. Uh, in the next episode, um, we're going to head off towards Four Tree City. And, uh, yeah, into my favorite part of the game, or one of my two favorite parts of the game. All right, I'm just trying to make it, uh, got it. Oh, you see that? You see those angles? You see that line I take? Crazy. I right, let's go ahead and save. And again, that's going to do it for today's episode of Pokemon Emerald. I'm sorry this episode was kind of scattered all over the place. I hope you did wind up enjoying. If you did, make sure you hit the like button down below. Comment whatever the question of the day is. If I came up with the question of the day that I said earlier, put it down there. Or whatever's under the game will be what it is and answer that in the comments below. And we'll see you on, uh, what's this, 25? So we'll see you on Monday for the next episode of Pokemon uh, Emerald, the insanely randomized Nuzlocke. Ah. <sighs> Until then, have a blessed day.